Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television, GPTV. I'm Brett. San Diego Comic Con's come and gone, but one of the big things at the convention is, of course, picking up exclusives at this show. Now, Hasbro's hooked us up with three of their exclusives to show off to you folks. Now, you can actually order some of these exclusives at the link below. Hopefully, they're not sold out by the time these videos go out or you see them. Uh, there's been tons of really cool stuff that's come out, a lot of Transformers figures. There's stuff for G.I. Joe, My Little Pony, Micronauts, Yokai Watch, you name it, it pretty much it was there. If it's a big property for Hasbro, uh, they had an exclusive for it. One of the really cool ones is this one of Soundwave. Now, this was a, a limited edition exclusive item that was, uh, I believe is the first time it's being offered here in the U.S. Now, Soundwave, you might remember for the old classic Transformers was a cassette player, and while this one has been updated a bit, and he is now a tablet. So Soundwave rescans into a no form and watches his minions from the mobile area. He and his trademark cassettes are integrated into our networked lives. The massive spies have taken the form of tablets and the components within them, gaining control of all functions, touchscreen, camera, microphone, GPS system, motion sensors, and collecting every piece of content or data generated from our planet. All the information they gather feeds back to Soundwave. He no longer has to steal that data. He owns it for the moment it's created. Now, this was actually pretty cool packaging. Nice, small, compact, and it has the figure inside. Now, I said he's supposed to be a tablet. Oh, he's a tablet. So I'm gonna go, we're gonna show him off for folks. Well, right away, there's been some cool things. You can see there's like tech printing on the back of this that I dig. Let's go and get the other items out of here. This one comes with instructions on how to transform him in this cool Decepticon emblem. Hopefully I'm not quite as inept in uh, transforming this one as I have been for other ones that we have displayed. Alright, so step one is doing this. Alright, step one's that. Step two is moving the hands out. Now, I grew up loving Transformers. I remember being able to go and put these together like it was going out of style back in the day. Um, was really really simple for me to do so we take off that plate clearly things have gotten a bit more complicated which is not a bad thing I kind of dig it myself All right, step three we are this pops off this comes out goes up five all right okay so this goes out And it seems to go up. So this goes up. I'm going to guess this. of his head gets connected. Something along the line of that.
thing with these. I was afraid to break them. Like you twist them the wrong way, and something's gonna snap. So I'm just trying to be careful because I think it would look really, really bad if I were to like break them. All right. So I'm gonna guess this goes up. This. <clears throat> This definitely goes like that. There we go. Okay, that's what I was missing. <coughs> I guess he is supposed to be... Pretty close to what he's supposed to be like. And then you can go and put this here. Yeah. So I think this is pretty close to what he's supposed to be like. That one I got together a little bit better than before. I feel much better about that, about my abilities. So, cool figure. I mean, the, the idea of, of updating Shockwave to be a tablet. It's really, really cool. It's smart. It seems like you sh that's what the uh, figure or the idea would be today. Um, so yeah, I, mean, it's, uh, I think it's a nice update. And kind of a cool figure. There's like this cool samurai thing going on with him. Um, I don't know how else to describe it. But definitely a nice update to a classic figure. And... 
this is the gun for, the, for him. Or it can be. Yep. So this pops off. That pops off. So this. That goes like that. Ow. And this goes like this. <clears throat> so then he's got a nice big massive hunkering gun on top of things. So overall, it's a cool figure. It's a nice update. It's pretty neat. Uh, it does kind of look like a tablet when it's converted. Uh, so yeah, interesting overall, I'm digging it, thank you very much Hasbro for hooking me up with this. As I said before, this is an exclusive that was available at San Diego Comic Con. If you want it, there is a link below, hopefully they still have some in stock. Um, but yeah, until next time, you can always catch us at graphicpolicy.com, we're uh, also on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, all at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. Thanks for watching, keep changing and converting and transforming your transformers and more importantly keep it geeky